Hey guys, this looks like a fun one. What are the values of A and B such that A plus B is equal to A times B, which is equal to A divided by B? So let's do this. First thing I'm noticing is B cannot be zero because of the A divided by B and we can't have division by zero. Next, let's try A equal to zero. Let's look at these two right here. Plug in zero for both of these A's. Zero plus B is equal to B and zero times B is equal to zero. So we have B equal to zero, but we said earlier B cannot equal zero. So we have a contradiction. That means that A cannot equal zero. And we can put a box around that. Let's get rid of this stuff and bring this up here. Now let's look at a times b equals a divided by b. Let's rewrite it like this and multiply both sides by b. And on the right hand side, since these b's cancel, we just have a. So b times b is b squared, so we have a times b squared is equal to a. If we divide both sides by a, we get b squared is equal to 1. So that means there are two possible values for b. It could be positive 1 or negative 1. For both scenarios, let's look at a plus b equals a times b. For both of these b's, let's plug in 1. a times 1 is a, so we end up with a plus 1 equals a. Let's subtract a from both sides. On the left hand side we have 1 and on the right hand side we have 0. So we end up with 1 equals 0. That is a contradiction. So that means that b cannot equal 1. Let's see what happens when we plug in b equals negative 1. We end up with a minus 1 is equal to negative a. Now we can subtract a from both sides. We get negative 1 equals negative 2a. Divide both sides by negative 2. We get 1 half is equal to a. And there's no contradiction here. So a equals 1 half and b equals negative 1. This is our solution. How exciting.